This is a strange signal, this one's bouncing left to right instead of up and down, normally things bounce up and down. Um, so I have no idea what this is. Is. Oh, it's patterned on that side. Yeah, it's like a rose sort of pattern. I'm not sure. Clean it up and show you at the end. Something else as well. But, you know, get in. That's a little coin as well. It seems very, very worn. I don't know, maybe it's not too bad. It's pretty worn on that side, but it looks like a young Victoria something or other. Possibly a threepenny bit. Maybe it's a sixpence. Got a hole in there, though, by the looks of it. So that's bummed out any value, but uh, I'll clean it up, show you at the end. Another nice signal from the top right hand corner of the screen. It says it was about 10 inches deep, so I'm going, going deep. That's a lump of coke. Give a very stable signal. Hmm, give a stable signal because there's something else in there. Yeah, it's a modern pre-decimal half penny. It's in amazingly good condition actually. It's not corroded. Generally you get these and they're falling apart or they're black. 1960 something. This is a stable signal reading 1246, um, reading 1246 both ways, so that's generally a good sign that you've got a, you know, a decent target or a large bad target. Yeah, not even switched on. A modern pre-decimal penny this time. From 1965. Again, great condition, not corroded. Next good strong signal, hitting towards the upper right hand side of the screen. It says it's not very deep. Maybe lying. Oh no. Oh yes. Looks like spindle wheel. It is a spindle wheel. Oh and a beautifully patterned one as well. See the little knobbly bits on it. Hole in the centre there. That'll be very nice when it's washed up. Nice. Well, this is the result of a two and a half hour hunt. There's a misshapen musket ball. Been in the wars, that one. And there's also a Victorian four pence, which unfortunately has been drilled. 1842, if that hadn't been drilled, it would have been worth quite a bit. 
It's actually been used on a charm bracelet or something, so it's all worn away, it's reacted with other metals, and it's it's pretty much knackered. Scrap silver, really. The two coins are both 1965. One's a half penny, the other one's a penny. Both um, Elizabeth II. Not worth anything. This is the thing that I said I would have a, a closer look at. Don't know what it is, but it's quite a nice design. <coughs> quite a nice design, sorry. Um, I don't know, possibly medieval Georgian, I don't know. No idea. Don't know what it was used for. Quite nice. And this thing is the cleaned up spindle whirl. Uh, it's far and away the best spindle whirl I've found. Unfortunately, it's been slightly clipped by a plough at some point. But um, still a very nice spindle whirl. Nice thick edge around it. Nice proud dots. It's actually got a star shape as well. Um, so that's really nice. Pleased with that. So, two and a half hours. A little handful of keepers. Well. That's probably the only one that's worth keeping, to be honest. Thanks for watching.